rescued by Steamtown founder F. Nelson Blunt and returned to service by Ross Rowland's High Iron Company, Nickel Plate Berkshire 759 was requested by n and to pull the last run of their Pocahontas on May 1, 1971. On that day, newly formed Amtrak assumed most of the nation's passenger trains, but had declined to continue service on the original n and So the final Pocahontas runs departed April 30th with arrivals at Cincinnati, train three, or Norfolk, train four, on May 1st. 759 handled train four from Roanoke to Norfolk. This two-part DVD takes you back to the freight run from Hagerstown, Maryland to Roanoke, Virginia on April 24, 1971, as the big Berkshire was positioned for its starring role on the Pocahontas a week later. You'll follow the engine south on the n and Shenandoah division with many run-bys, pacing, and the servicing stop at Shenandoah in film from Douglas M. Brown and Jim Kreider. Then in part two, you'll follow the 759 from Roanoke over the Blue Ridge grade and many other locations as she leads train four to Norfolk for the final time on May 1st, 1971. It's an hour and 15 minutes of fast-paced steam action with authentic 759 sound from these very runs. Plus, we've added 15 minutes of previews of our steam and diesel on the nickel plate and Pocahontas Glory Norfolk and Western videos to round out this 90-minute program. The DVD has chapters and you can choose to watch it with or without narration. You'll love Doug Brown's late afternoon pacing sequence as Ross Rowland has the 759 sprinting eastward at track speed. Don't miss Nickel Plate 759 and the last Pocahontas. Order yours today. Look for item 057 on our website, www.heronrail.com or call our toll-free number, 1-800-783-3886.